All right, here we go. Hello, everybody. Uh, welcome back to the sixth Satanic Saturday. Probably the last one for Dead Space. I think we're almost certainly going to be finishing up the game today, so that'll be pretty fun. That'll be pretty exciting. It's been a while since I've seen the ending of this game. Why is that Ishimura, like, symbol, like, so egg-shaped? It wasn't like a circle. It was all weird and messed up. So, um, we go yonder ways. Did we go ahead and- oh, we didn't break this box. I don't think we checked out the bathroom either, and of course, everyone knows you gotta go investigate the bathrooms in horror games because you'll never know what you'll see in the toilets. Maybe it'll be like a dead, decapitated head. Look at those toilets. Those are some weird toilets. Do they really need, like, backs? Uh, like uh, backs to the chairs like that big for their for their toilets in this universe I don't know maybe in the maybe it's for people like Isaac who have like such horrible posture to go ahead and try to fix that so we go that way so I'm going to imagine that we just ignore that elevator for now probably will end up being somewhere that we'll have to come back to but oh hello hello I heard a pretty- oh god, a fat one! I hate the fat ones. Okay, well let's try to deal with him now then. Seeing as he is like, so far away, might make the most sense. There's some babies. I actually did not know that there's so many enemies down there right now. If there ain't babies, let them blow up! Um, did he spawn any? I don't think he spawned any babies, so that's gonna be good for us. Hello, how's it going down there? You having a nice time? Or, uh, we little ones. Hello, Swaganator! Welcome to the stream! Uh, I think you are actually indeed correct in saying first. I think you are the first one here for today, so that's pretty cool. Um, have you watched Breaking Bad? I love Breaking Bad. Breaking Bad is really, really good. Um, Brian Cranston actually, pre-Breaking Bad, I, I, I grew up on Brian, Brian Cranston because I watched, um, Malcolm in the Middle as I grew up, a lot of it. So Malcolm in the Middle is actually, without a doubt, my favorite actor actor in the world. So, if I if I hadn't seen Breaking Bad, it would be uh, quite quite a shaming uh, thing to say the least. So, you know what? Before we upgrade anything else, let's actually go ahead and continue working our way towards um, the rest of these power nodes. Let's actually turn down the volume for myself. The game is really loud right now for some reason. Um, hopefully it's not loud for you guys, but I think everything should be balanced out, so I don't think that'll be a problem. But yeah, the game's just being like, blah, 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 blah. Um, just, uh, oh god, I should pause for this, especially since I think I just took damage. Just watched, uh, one and a half seasons, so good. And Ma I know, Malcolm in the Middle is one of the greatest comedies of all time, in my opinion. I don't know if I would say the greatest. Probably wouldn't actually. Uh, I think I would put something like The Simpsons higher, higher up on that list. Smash the babies! Smash the babies! Taste the babies! It's like a Skittles commercial, just, just a little bit darker. I mean, eh, not not all that much darker. Everyone knows that Skittles commercials are among some of the the darkest and most cruel commercials ever, uh, ever imaginable. We are actually speaking about dark commercials though now that i've started mentioning that um actually i should finish my thing on breaking bad the one thing i will say on breaking bad that's a show that just keeps getting better and better so you're in for a wild ride my good my good sir like really it, it, it gets hard to believe at times but like that that it actually can escalate anymore but my favorite thing about that show is actually that it, it, it's just a story a, it, it's the story of a man who just continually gets himself into, like, a deeper and deeper hole that he has to dig himself out of, you know? Just ends up, like, making things worse and worse. And when you think they're as bad as they could possibly be, he pulls out of it a little bit, only to make uh, it even worse than it began a little bit later. So it's, it's such a good story, especially since all the characters are so well done in that show. Such good writing. Um, but anyways, as I was saying, things that are actually childhood friendly, a ch a ch a child friendly, that actually are pretty dark. You know what? S uh, like, breakfast mascots are kind of dark. This, uh, well, not bre breakfast mascots, uh, breakfast commercials. Because all it is is these greedy little kids keeping cereal from, uh, like, people who just want some. Like the Trix Rabbit. 
I mean, sure, he's trying to steal it from time to time, but like, or, or maybe more often than not. But did they ever consider that if they just shared their cereal, maybe the Trix Rabbit would leave him alone? Or my favorite occurrence is the freaking the the freaking Lucky Charms Repli Leprechaun. They're stealing from him. Those kids are stealing. <laughs> The, the cereal doesn't belong to them, it belongs to him, and they're just going, like, and abusing him and forcing him to, uh, hand it over to them. It's, it's, it's quite sad, really, if you consider everything. So, I think we're actually going to use a, a med kit, especially since we have a lot of them at this time being, so we could, uh, go ahead and get more of this machine gun ammo. Then, question is, do we use the Ripper? We don't have any ammo for it in our inventory, so I think we're gonna go with the line launcher. Which honestly might be a really good idea to use that weapon a lot, because I don't know how much longer the line launcher is actually gonna be all that good, because it will be really good uh, for any of the uh, remaining basic monsters, but it's pretty bad against bosses, at least in my opinion. Retrieving cargo, gathering resources. It doesn't look like Red Burning Dragon is in here, but I just want to ask, is Red Burning Dragon in here right now? Because I have a special, special surprise for him, if, uh, if he actually is. Uh, oh, there it is! There's the marker. Oh, it's this crummy thing where we got, like, pull it along? Oh, good lord. Oh, lord! Okay, I was not expecting that to happen. Up! Uh, clearly, it's been quite a while since I played this game. I'm now almost dead. <laughs> Thank you for that game. Uh, let's actually stop hitting me. Just give me like a second of freedom, please. Good lord, game didn't even like. Oh god, dude, these guys have uh, armor on their legs, so we need to take them from the top down. All right. Um. Hopefully. Oh god. Everyone is everywhere. Uh. So how about that Ebola? How about that Ebola? I'm sorry. I don't know what you're talking about. This is actually. Uh, this is probably gonna make me a complete, like, seem like a complete idiot, but I, I, I know I've heard the word Ebola, but I don't remember off the top of my head when Ebola actually is. Fair enough! Uh, no! That's a bad tentacle! Ah, that's a very bad tentacle. No harassing me. Okay, so let's actually go ahead and pull out the Ripper, because the Ripper will be good against the fat ones. Oh, uh, are you making babies? You better not be making babies. No, this one's making babies! Oh! So that one way, way back when actually did make babies. They just spawned those guys now. That's interesting. Destroy him! Yes! Come on. Destroy you too. You still have one, but he's dead anyways. I don't know if enemies spawn endlessly in this area. I don't think they do. Hopefully they don't. Oh, he isn't in there. Okay, thank you very much. I always forget that you actually can uh, examine that. Um, or... or uh, no, I'm so so afraid. I don't. I also don't really want to use the line launcher for this guy. You know what? Let's just grab the machine gun. We'll be able to deal with him okay. And it, it, it does also appear that we have um whatever. Okay, no more slow motions. We're just gonna kill him the old-fashioned way. Just shoot him normally. There we go. Actually, that. Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh! <laughs> I hate the explosive dudes. Leave me alone, please. It's a million and one like jerkwads on this map right now so now we're gonna have another tentacle pop up would love to deal with you quite nicely get you out of here so i can actually happily continue on with my life anything gonna pop out for me no i cannot come on you fiend come on i challenge you to a duel a duel of fates a duel in which i'm going to come out to where you can hit me then immediately walk away, so it's not really a duel because you can't really hit me back. Kind of, uh, abusing the system here, but honestly, I don't really care. Come on, die! He's got too much health! I hope his health doesn't refresh every time he goes down. I, I don't think he would, it would, but it's taking an absurd amount of shots right now. Let's actually try to slow him. Oh, that was almost- Yep, that was a miss, I thought was. That was really bad. You know what? Fine. This calls for the line lot. I mean, the uh, plasma cutter. Come on, boy! Come on! Let me show you how a real man shoots his gun! Oh, good boy. Come on! Just die! <laughs> He's unstoppable! 
this man is freaking unstoppable. Okay, so now you can hit me if you want. Please don't, though. Okay. He's apparently gonna shoot over there like a freaking idiot. I don't know why he... No! Come back! Stop being a nuisance. Oh my god, I hate this game so much sometimes. Can you just die? I've used so many shots on this guy! He's unstoppable! He's literally unstoppable. Also, that's that's another question I have. Are there just like a million of these types of giant enemies on the ship? Or is there we go, finally. Or is it all just the same one? I'd imagine it's a different one since we did kill that one that was like on the outside of the ship, but I don't know. Maybe they're both part of the same one. Ah, Red Burning Dragon! I was actually just uh, talking about you. I watched the latest log, her, uh, watched the latest log Horizon 2. Can't hear for 11 minutes. Oh, you're watching it right now. Okay, I see. All right. Well, um, it is, I, I presume then the new episode of that show came out right now. So, um, once once that's once that uh, once that's done, Red Burning Dragon will have to talk, and hopefully you'll be able to uh, relate to the conversation that I want to bring up, so I can aid her. We'll, we'll just have to see once the surprise can be revealed. Oh, hey, buddy, how's it going? Don't have any slow-mo juice, which is a little bit unfortunate, but you know we're, we're just gonna use up as many. Line launcher shots as we can, because I hate this weapon. Oh, he's still alive. Stop being a bully. There we go. No, I, I mean, not line launcher, um, cutter. Ripper. Ripper shots. I don't want the ripper anymore. Can you stop giving me ammo for it and give me, like, ammo for better weapons? Be kind of nice game. Sayonara, suckers! I don't know if I needed to stay down here, but I'm pretty sure I don't. So let's go ahead, um... We need two more power nodes to be able to upload our, I mean, what the hell? They, they're able to, the vents, the vents. <laughs> I should have known they'd be able to make their way up here, but I actually did not notice that there's a vent up here. That was obviously my, my bad. Um, so you can like stop being such a jerk wide. We took a little bit of damage there, but honestly that might have been worth it. It'll give us some, um, some new, uh, am, am, additional ammunition for better weapons. So let's actually use both of our power nodes. Go ahead and max out our health. Does that also heal us? Ah, it doesn't appear. Uh, it doesn't appear, so. Uh, yes, indeed. That is what I wanted to talk about, Red Burning Dragon. But, oh, no, it did heal us. That's so cool. Um, I'll, I'll let you finish your show first before I, I get into all that because I want to I wanna distract you to focusing on something Take it else. To the hangar bay and get the marker on the shuttle. I'm Don't tell me what to do, now. Kendra. I'll give you a big old, uh, a uh, big old punch in the face. Yeah! Give you a big old slap. Well, get out of here! Get out of my life! Let me see. Probably should go back to the, uh, line launcher, line rack, or whatever it's called. I'm never gonna know the names of the weapons in this game. <laughs> I'm too much of a silly billy papa chili. Um, except for the plasma car, I'll always know the plasma car because the plasma car is the greatest weapon of all times. Um, anything for me here? Which way do we go? Okay. Okay, dokie, sir. Um, I'm on my laptop. I have regained my mod powers. Glory to the world. Welcome back to being a, a an almighty and powerful mod, Red Burning Dragon. You see. Uh, let's go ahead and go in here. I don't think we need to go in here. I just want to grab the, uh, the big old box juices. We're back to the beginning, everyone. Oh, happy day. <laughs> Who would have thought? What a happy situation for everyone. Is this when things are going to get sad? When, oh, oh, wonderful. Okay, we got to kill a million dudes first. Hello? Ah, I spy with my little eye. Whoa, that's, what? Wow, we're fighting early game enemies. I'm actually kind of really surprised. And I'm thank- No! No! You're a late game enemy! You're not supposed to be here! You're supposed to be nice to me, game! You're being nice, but then you tricked me! You spat in my face! Oh god, get away from me, please. Um, I don't- Okay, yeah, we're not low health at all. Isaac, can you, like, run, buddy? Just run! Don't, uh, stand there like a dingleberry. Oh, hello! Please get out of my face. I don't- I, I, I appreciate the loving embrace that you're trying to give me, but it's also not really appreciated. 
<laughs> it's a bad touch. Bad touch from these monsters, and I don't like any of that nonsense. Okay, so we should probably go back to this poopity poop of a weapon. Uh, open sesame. Um. I'm going to talk to Shuffle. Got to be careful now. Oh, yeah, this is totally it, isn't it? Is the... Th oh, there's the ping! Yeah! Or the peng? No, the peng. P-E-N-G. Yeah! We've got all the money in the world. And an achievement? Are there just no achievements for this game? There might not be achievements for this game on, uh... On, um... On Steam. Where did our ship go? Our ship used to be here, but it's like vanished off of the face of the earth. Hey, box, box, you wanna be mine? Uh, would you be mine? Could you be mine? Could you be my box? I'd really appreciate that. I want you! I want you so bad! The box just won't have it. Well, what a negative Nancy. I don't like that box. It's a big old jerk. All right, let's just keep moseying on, moseying on along. Do I have to go over to him? I don't think I could go over to him from going this way. Oh, I'm supposed to, like, oh. Okay, I was just walking the wrong way like it's old Ding Dong. That's my bad. Yeah, but what happened to our ship? We're in the hangar where our ship was. Shouldn't there still be wreckage here? Unless the monsters just like freaking ate it. I don't know what's up with that. That's kind of weird. <laughs> this game's universe confuses me sometimes. Oh, okay, this door just unlocked. Thank you. Um, can I get any items from it? From any of these? It does not appear so. Um, do I go in here yet? Oh, I do have to go in there. I want to say hi to our friends, though. Oh, he's not even, like, opening a way for me to get to him. What a jerkwad. <laughs> he's like, no, you're not allowed inside. I'm going to keep the door locked until you bring me the marker. No marker and no friendship for us. I don't like it. Being a big old jerkwad about that. Anyways, um, I I think we, I, I I'm still not entirely sure. Oh, cool. We actually just bring the marker straight up from here. That's pretty nice. Yeah. Zero gravity online. It's what the it's what the big boys play on. Zero gravity mode. I don't know why the big boys would play on zero gravity mode over anything else, but you know that's that's just one saying. Um, okay, so the marker, I think, should pop up right about there? I don't know where the marker comes up, but you know what, first let's actually, uh, jump over here and work our way towards that box, because that box is gonna become mine, and there's nothing, uh, nothing it could say about it. I, I'm gonna claim the, I'm gonna claim the in the name of Mars! Um, whatever that guy talks like. There we go! You're mine! There we go. I don't know why we couldn't jump there, that was kind of weird. The box? I want you. I'm gonna break you open and eat all your lovely innards. Or at least keep them for mine. I actually, so you, oh sweet, a three health up. Or a three health med kit, like the, the med kit to the third power. That's what I'll call that. Um, hello cookie stealer, welcome to the stream. How have you been? It's been too long. It's been far, far, far too long. Check it out, we could actually look out at space. Oh no! Hello? Don't touch my butt. Oh god, they're touching my butt with all their evil lasers. Hey, 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 can you like stand still, baby? Um, sounds like. Actually, I think that's like the second or third time I've uh, talked to one of those guys and I felt like I've been talking to like a girlfriend or something and being like, hey, can you just stand still, baby? I wanna talk to you. Okay, so we're out of that. Get this thing going and start killing some babies. That's one down. Two shots for it, but he actually gave us some uh, line launcher ammo in return, so that's pretty nice. Shoot, there's more than one baby still. Okay, um, we're gonna. S no, no, no. We're gonna shoot this one. And now we should have a chance to smash. Smash. Smash! We gotta smash him before the duration ends. He's getting away. You can't e escape me. You can't escape me. Get back here. <laughs> no running away! Oh, come on, Isaac, you missed! Like a freaking ding-dong! There we go. Uh, get- No! No! There we go. Okay, we got the Ripper ammo before it flew away. So we took a little extra hits for that, but it was- It was well worth it, to say the least. Um... So, yes. Uh, there it is. I thought there was some line. 
uh, sign some line rack ammo. That's what it is. Uh, let's let's go ahead and go to that box because we need to get to the bottom floor anyways, and that box is um probably around the area that we need to go to continue on our glorious and almighty mission of greatness. So let's see. Ripper, um, we probably should just sell the Ripper, I don't know, the Ripper sucks so much. <laughs> it's the biggest, it, it is the most butts of all weapon in this, of all weapons in this game. If there's, there could be a mo, if there was like, a really just awful, awful weapon in this game, I actually think the Ripper might be one of them. Used to love it when I was younger, but apparently at all. My love for it is all over now. It's all over. Oh, okay, so that like changes the track. Wait, so are there like two things we need to bring up? What the hell is happening here? I'm, I'm confused. I, I don't know what's happening in this game. I don't know what's happening with anything anymore. My, my whole, oh, there we go. Okay, so we gotta grab you. Mosey on along. Oh, sweet. Health, uh, I mean, items. It's done! Well, uh, okay then, Red, uh, Red Burning Jack, and I wanted to say, and of course anyone else who can contribute to this conversation, I'd love to talk about with you guys. Uh, obviously, I can't say a hell of a lot, because, um, uh, I, I, I haven't seen very much of it, and I want to, uh, and I would prefer for you guys to refrain from any spoilers, of course, but I just watched, uh, the first episode of, um, No Game, No Life, uh, yesterday, and I thought it was pretty good. Uh, I, I... I'm not absolutely crazy about it, but uh, as you guys have told me, um, with, with animes, it is one of those things where you really um, have to... Wait, wait, why can't I grab it? Do I have to grab it from there? Because that is the grab... Oh no, that's the jumping button. I was pressing the wrong combination. Apparently I forgot what the controls are. Aim and then X is slow-mo, so... Okay, it's it's aim and B, that's what it is. I just completely forgot. But yeah, I watched the first episode of No Game, No Life. I thought it was pretty good. Like I said, I'm, I'm, I'm not, like, incredibly into it yet. And there actually were some things that, um... I wasn't incredibly crazy about that happened in it. Um... Uh, but I, I, I could get to those in a bit. But I will say, above all else, I really loved the colors in it. Like, the, the colors were just so freaking fantastic in that anime. Oh, so, okay, so then we pull it down there. So we could do a little swappy swappy here, and then we pull it back. And, and then get started on that. So, um... It gets better with time. Yeah, yeah, I thought it. I, I, I was expecting it would. Like from from what I've understood. Like all, all shows, uh, most shows start off a little bit slow. But you bet. Uh, uh, I remember you guys mentioning me uh, to me before, especially with the animes in general. It usually takes like a couple of uh, episodes to really start getting into motion. Oh God! There's a there's a an angry beast right at my doorstep. It's gonna blow up once. Twice? Yes! Oh, suck it, buddy. Didn't even have to use any weapons, and there's another one coming at us. Okay, let's let's try to deal with him the same way, because I really, really hate these guys. Uh, time to egg you on. Why are you gonna egg me on? Are you gonna... Are you are you seducing me? Are you gonna egg me on in, in a seductive manner, or are, we, or are you just gonna, like, harass me or something? Or who knows, maybe you're gonna turn into one of these beasts and come into my life and try to make a... Make a mockery of everything I hold dear. That guy just, like, exploded into all hell. Um, I wish he left his ammo behind, but I don't know if I could find that anywhere. Mm. You will get addicted on episode 6. Sounds pretty cool, man. I, I gotta say, I do like the concept of it a lot. I think it's pretty interesting, but, uh... I, I, that's the other thing with with animes in particular. I, I, there, there's shows where you do have to really suspend your 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 disbelief in many cases, um, or leave your uh, oh hey baby what's up? Leave your uh, suspension of disbelief like at the door before games started. But I do uh, kind of have to wonder like, what the? Where are they? Like I know they're like in another dimension or another world, but did they get like sucked into a computer Tron style? Uh, like. Uh, of course, if this actually is a plot-relevant point, don't don't spoil it for me. But you actually can tell me whether or not they actually do explain that. I suppose. Um, 
Because, like, the, 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 it's, there's just this weird, like, evil, like, monster hands that comes out and, like, pulls him in, but then it's, like, the god of the world, like, all sorts of stuff kind of, like, confused me a little, but... <laughs> but I do like the idea of, uh, characters be, like, people who are, like, devoted and dedicated to games being sucked into a world that completely runs on games. Honestly, that kind of whole thing where games, um kind of, like, rule everything and, and decide, like, life and death even or, or something like that reminded me actually a lot about of Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, Season Zero or, um, the, the first, like, comics for Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, which are also by far my favorites. Where, li like, he's always challenging the dudes to a game. He's like, oh, we're gonna do a game, see? And I'm gonna eat your face off. Uh, was that, like... I do have to go back down, okay. What am I supposed to do? I imagine I don't carry it over there. Oh, I gotta go back to the control room. That was a really weird way of the game telling me that. It's like the game goes down and goes back up. Um, the colors to give the uh, fanatic feel with the bright colors. Did, did I actually mention the, the colors? Because I did want to mention them. Because I, I think I did say that's my favorite thing about the show. Because the art style is so, like beautiful with how like neon it is and stuff like that at, at least of course whenever it's in like the fantasy game world and stuff like that like really um that that first like game that they're playing and this is another question i have that that i'll get to in a sec when when they were first playing that uh computer game and it was showing like the game play uh like i i suppose what was being seen on the screen or whatever um when we were watching all that um and the blanks four characters defeated like a thousand one thousand and two hundred people or whatever um th that was just like so beautiful with like all the neon colors and stuff like that whenever people would like swing with weapons it would have this like nice blue or like red glow to it that was one of my favorite things about for sure okay yeah and that now is when now is when the sad moment happens i'm pretty sure and oh Hello, buddy. What's up? Join me. Together, we can stop this hive mind. We can end this nightmare at last. Yeah, buddy. I'll end your nightmare any day. Oh yeah, there he is. Hi, oh, buddy. How's it going? Over here. Hurry. There's no time to waste. We must do it. Do we see like? Oh no, we don't even see her hand pop out. Guts and gore. Hey, poor, poor man. Here, let me give you. A, let me help you with that. I'm gonna stomp your knees. See, I'm, I'm, I'm just trying to transition the- oh, actually, we're like stomping his groin. We're trying to stomp him in the balls, so- oh god, we took off his legs. <laughs> we're trying to stomp him in the balls, so uh, the pain of the shot in his stomach would be removed. So we're, we're just trying to help him, everything considered. I love that guy. That poor guy Sorry, gone forever. I couldn't let him go through with it. Oh, hello, bitch. I suppose I should thank you for finding the marker. We even managed without help from the USM Valor. Thank you for helping me find him, by the way. My department's been looking for this place for a long time. See what kind didn't know us? It was the government's mess to begin with. This whole planet is one big experiment. The marker? This <laughs> divine relic? Made by man. They reverse engineered it a couple of hundred years ago from the real marker. A true alien artifact recovered on Earth. They dug it up, studied it, and they made it their own. Then they brought it to Aegis 7 and activated it. And you've seen the result. The stuff of nightmares. They sealed the system. You're the stuff no of my nightmares, wiser. lady. But then the CEC blunders in and starts tearing the planet apart. The experiment was still alive. Time was right about the hive mind. The marker would contain it, but that doesn't matter now, does it? I have the marker, and this entire system can go to hell. For what it's worth, you did a great job, Isaac. See you around. Or maybe not. God, I hate you so much. I Nicole, I need you to help me. Help us. Now. I'm, I'm in the flight control room. Please, Isaac, hurry. Please. I love you. I'm coming for you, my love! Oh, that's the wrong way, okay. Well, we gotta bring this guy with us. I mean, he helped us so much along the way. We just have to bring him along our journey, as long as things don't take too long. Uh, the god sent them to his world. 
I know, but like, I, what is it in like reality? <laughs> like, like, are they just like sitting at this computer screen, like kind of like comatose? Are they just there in their minds, or were they literally like sucked in, like Tron style, into this other dimension? Hey, don't leave me, buddy. We're meant to be together, and we're going to be together forever. Is this really just where the comms, like, or the computer controls are? Just right up here, or was there, like, an elevator up here? Uh, get out of here, box. I want- I want my friend. Yeah! You and me together forever! I love you. Um... Uh, but, but what was the other thing that I was going to say? I feel like, uh, fancy... Uh, oh, uh, not, okay, it's, uh, <laughs> I know I hate autocorrect, autocorrect is like the bane of my existence. It, it helps so much in some occasions, but I feel like literally like half the time it just ruins everything. Um, but, uh, was it extreme? It was totally extreme. Everything is extreme here. Uh, n n nothing isn't extreme. But, uh, wh wh what was I going to... <laughs> Don't lose your head. We'll never lose our head. This this head is gonna be with us forever. We we need him. He's helped us so long. He he's the real love of our lives. No! Not this guy! I thought it was done with this guy! Oh my god, this guy is all the butts! Worst enemy in this entire game right here. Okay, so, um... Come on! We gotta destroy his final arm! So we can actually, like, be happy with our lives! We're out of line launcher ammo? Oh, good lord. Okay, how about this? Just, like, eat all the blades. I don't want this ammo anyway, so... Oh, okay, I killed him. I need to remember, that's the one guy that the, uh, the Ripper is actually good against. Oh, no. <gasps> oh, no! No! Where'd his head go? Did we lose him? Oh, he's, he's gone. He's gone. He's no more. I'm so sad. That's, <laughs> the love of my life is gone. Oh, what a shame. Uh, teleported the god, uh, is the god of games through the game, uh, sent them to the world. I, I, it's still can, I have no idea. <laughs> I imagine it's one of those things where it, you're not supposed to ask that question, not supposed to ask how it works, because then I wonder, is she literally a god, or is she just like a god in their world, you know? Um, because it is a she, right? Like, Trip or Tur, I, I don't remember what exactly the name was. Oh, hey, how's it going? I thought we'd be together again. God, I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for what I did. I never wanted to hurt you. you she doesn't you bleed. You can hide so well from here. Make us whole again. Make us whole again. <laughs> I'm like shooting her with blades and she's like, make us whole again, Isaac. Make us whole. I know, I lost the head. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to. It was the love of my life. Everything I, that ever meant anything to me and it's gone forever. Oh, this is the best part where we make like Cassandra really mad. She's about to be like, ah, what are you doing, Isaac? Don't do that. No. Isaac, what the hell are you doing? You're making a big mistake. Not over. <laughs> Domo. Domo. Encryption USG 09. Repeat. Shuttle has ejected escape pod. It doesn't matter. She can't escape her fate. None of us can. You, you rat girl. You so rat. I love you for it. Here Magic. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah probably is just kind of a magic thing. But, um. So close, Isaac. There was also one other thing that yep, kind of confused me about it. Um, we'll that I'm trying to remember, but that's what. Uh, just so you know, Redburn and Dragon, I was really into it, and and I ask these questions about like everything I see, regardless of whether or not I like it. So so don't hear me saying all these things and be like, uh, or I, I hope you wouldn't hear those things and be like he didn't like the show because it's definitely interesting, and I am I am getting into it. Um, in fact, you're a blue note. You are a Christian. You should watch it. You should watch um, No Game, No Life, and we then then you could join in our conversation about it, and we could talk about it or something. Since like it seems like a pretty good show. Basically, basically. Um. Oh, I remember the other thing that I wasn't too excited about. I'll explain that in, in a sec. Um. 
And once again, I'm, I actually hope that the ending... Oh, finally the door opens. Took like a million and one years. Um, but basically, No Game No Life is this new anime that Red Burning Dragon has gotten me into about like these, um, these two, like, kids or like teens or young adults. One of them's definitely a kid. The other one, I would say, is probably like in his teens. These two siblings, um, who are like obsessed with games and uh, somehow are not incredibly obese because the, basically their whole life is video games. Basically, like they're uh, the, all, all they do is play like games and stuff like that. But some somehow they're pretty fit, like surprisingly fit to be. No, I thought I slow moed you. Ah, uh, I guess I didn't do it in time. Okay, I I just want to skip these jerkwads. Oh my god, can you like please not? Be a jerk. Thank you. Okay, run, Isaac. Run like the wind. Actually, it wouldn't surprise me if I can't get in here unless I kill them. Because it wouldn't surprise me if I... Oh, no, it actually worked perfectly fine. <laughs> well, that was easy. Thank you, game. Honey, how are you dealing out against those monsters? Oh, I got in perfectly fine. Nice. She actually got through with uh, taking less Doing damage right than me. Isaac. We're together now, the way it always should have been. Oh. You come back for me. Nothing could stop us now. Give us a kiss. Give us a kiss. Oh. Oh well. Eighteen-year-old brother and his little sister. Okay. Sword Art Online, uh, Sword Art Online is actually one of the ones that, um, I have on my list of shows that people have, uh, been requ uh, telling me that I should watch. I haven't heard of Dead Man Wonderland, so I'll, I'll write, I'll add that to the list. Dead. Man. Wonderland. There we go. Man, we actually might finish Dead Space early, which will be, uh, a bit of a surprise to me, for sure. Um, uh, you never question magic. It only hurts your head. I speak from experience. That's a good point. Um, they always forget to disable. I know, seriously, they do always forget to disable the tractor beam. Those, those silly, silly ding-dongs. Always messing up. Cassandra is pretty much a complete idiot, though, so if anyone would ma make that mistake, it would be her. Um, that's exactly what you needed to hear. Hell yeah. I like how this chapter just started by plopping me right here. Not even a cutscene or anything. I found that kind of funny. Um, and like we're not, we can't even go in to say hi to our wife. That's kind of really silly. Oh, never mind. Uh, apparently I was wrong. How you doing? How you, how you doing, baby? How's it going? Uh, okay, yeah, so this is this is the portion that kind of sucks because it's basically a dragging game for half the time now uh, Because we just got bring the the thingamadoohickey everywhere we go everywhere we go people want to know Oh, excuse me <laughs> Everywhere we go people want to know where do we bring the relic or whatever it's called so I tell them we bring it to the Oh, the marker, not the relic. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Uh, but I wanted to say the other thing that uh, I'm not... Uh, that that kind of rubbed me a little bit the wrong way. But, you know, it's... Uh, they're, they're, the characters are, like, young... Like, st especially the... I mean, even the brother is still, like, a teenager. Uh, like, Oh, is that just a... No, that's... Those are men. Look at them. They're so silly just hanging in there. Um, oh, look at this guy. Hey, how's it going? You're missing your head. That sucks. Um, but, uh, the show has that kind of, like, gloom and doom kind of, like, theme to it, where the characters are like, oh, the real world, like, sucks, um, I just, like, belong in my, m my game world and stuff like that, and that's, that's the kind of thing that, like, I can relate to, because I was, I, I definitely had a period of my life when I was like that, but... Honestly, I kind of, what I what I want the ending of the show to be like because obviously once again Red Burning Dragon don't spoil anything for me But this this is a relatively short uh, uh, Show right like this is just like one of those single season animes where it's only like 13 episodes or so um, I believe that's what you told me um, 
that this one is, but it, it might have been a different one, or, or whoever was the person who told me this. Um, but, uh, honestly, what I would kind of like, how I would kind of like the show ending would be that they actually, you know, e exit the game world and go back to reality and, and learn to, like, le learn the beauty of Earth and stuff like that, because... Honestly, a lot of it's it, it, I, it made me think a lot about video games that um, that I love that actually really make me appreciate either like communicating with others in the real world, um, or um, or just like the world in general. And be, because really, like some of my favorite games are actually the ones that have a message that is basically go outdoors and live your life. Like, uh, one of my favorite examples of that would be, um, frickin' amazing game, uh, uh of course now I'm blanking, L Little Inferno. Like, Little Inferno is such a good game. And it, it's kind of ironic in some ways, too, and this is part of why I love it, because basically you play the whole game just sitting in front of a fireplace, um, burning objects, and then... Oh, hello there, buddy. And, of course, I, I'm not gonna spoil what happens at the end of the game, because it is so freaking... It's it, honestly, I think Little Inferno may be one of my favorite, uh, games ever made from an experience point of view, because really, it... The ending of it is, like, pure magic, in my opinion. Um, but, uh, be, I, 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 I feel okay with saying it's message, because I, I think the message isn't the important thing, it's how it's delivered. Um, and the ending message of the game is basically go outdoors and experience the world and live your life. Don't be cooped up in front of, like, just uh, a monitor for, for the rest of your life, and it's a really good message, and it's carried out in a really, really good way. Um, and it's basically saying, like, more on the lines of do it because the world is such a beautiful place, you know? It's, it's really cool. Oh, there's an evil man behind me. Run! So, uh, I'm honestly guessing that that isn't how No Game No Life uh, ends. And of course, do even, even if it isn't, and you're just telling me so I know that, uh, don't, don't go ahead and spoil that for me, um, uh, because then I would know, uh, one thing that couldn't possibly be an ending for it, you know? Um, but, but that's, that's one thing that, personally, I, I would like to see, because, uh, like I was saying before, I, I could definitely relate to that kind of experience, because I think I did definitely, like, live that, um, ideal for a period of my life, but... I don't know, I'm, uh, I'm more optimistic about things now, and I'm, I'm looking at these kids and being like, oh, that's a little sad. <laughs> I kind of wish they could have, uh, gone to actually live in the real world, because I, I feel like they didn't get a chance, you know? Um, lag. Oh, that was unfortunate. Um, now I gotta go catch up because I went on that whole big old dis discussion about that. Uh... Uh, uh, yeah, I already read that part. Um, oh, Dead Man Wonderland is on Netflix. Okay, then I then I should definitely get that chance. I don't know if I have. I oh, are either of my computers attached to a Netflix account? Uh, really, all it would be is figuring out what the password is, so it's not really a hassle at all. It's still just an annoyance. <laughs> All right, let's sell our stuff. You know what, I think what we're actually gonna do if uh, this game wouldn't accidentally click to the right, I think we're actually gonna sell our Ripper Blades and then the Ripper and buy a new weapon because the Ripper is the biggest of all buds, you know? We, we don't want the Ripper anymore. Ripper's gonna be no more. Let's, uh, which one was better? The Force Gun or the Contact Beam? A uh, short range kinetic boost device and heavy damage energy projectile. Yeah, that's like the single burst one. So I think the four, wasn't the force, isn't this like the shotgun of this game? I think that's what it is. So let's actually get the force gun. We'll get our final suit upgrade, so we'll be the coolest looking man in the world. <laughs> oh, that typo again. I love that typo so much. Welcome back, Swaganato, welcome back. Along with the first season of Sword Art Online. Okay, so then I'll have to watch that on, on Netflix. Uh is one, um, uh, that story cuts off at the end. Uh, what do you mean by that, Red Burning Dragon? Do you mean it just, like, ends, uh, 
abruptly? Or what, like they unfortunately weren't able to continue the show and it was canceled or something? Or, or, or what? Um, I'm a little bit confused by what exactly you mean by that. Man, look at how far our suit has become. That's one of my favorite things about this game, seeing uh, how crazy the upgrade, uh, the, or the development of the suit gets. By all the power nodes in the world! We're only able to get seven, so that's not an absurdly high amount, but that's still pretty good for us, I'd say. We'll be able to use six of them if we uh, haven't bought any more than that. I think we get like a little cutscene or a video in here. Ah, oh, we already have the force, uh, the force gun set up. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, the episode. Oh, the episodes are greenlit. That's pretty cool. Oh, for for English. So th so the dubbing team has a green light pay or, or or get gets green light then that's interesting 200 episodes in total but netflix doesn't have them all oh my god that show's long i'm not gonna lie that might kind of turn me off of it a little because i don't think i'd want to watch a show that's like a thousand years long but you know if, if i got really into it that could probably change my mind it's, it's just one of those things where honestly partially I don't want to get into it because of uh, how like how much of an investment it would be. Woo! 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 People are just having fun times, you know. Look at them. Even when even when you're dead, doesn't mean you can't uh, can't swing around a little and have some good times. Oh, look at them go. All right, buddy, we're gonna blow you to pieces. Yeah, this one is definitely the shotgun weapon, if I remember correctly. So that's gotta be pretty cool. Really makes me wish I used it earlier. I totally forgot what this weapon was like, because this is a really, really cool weapon. Hello, bitch! I command you to become mine. Egg, you're cute. Oh, I thank you, Swagonator. You're cute as well. <laughs> yes, indeed. I don't think we need air anymore, so we're going to ignore that. Um, do we want to get more of this? Honestly, I, we probably won't use stasis all that much anymore, so let's actually just ignore that. Let's, uh, let's max out the plasma card just so we could have the glory of having it maxed out. And then I actually think we're gonna work a lot on the force gun, or, uh, yeah, yeah, let's go for damage. Um, capacity, and then another one for damage. And then for the shop, we could go and buy another power node. Because I actually think there is, uh, one more area that requires a power node to actually unlock uh, access to the thing on this um, area uh, of the game, on this final mission. So let's go ahead and sell this goal. Oh, that doesn't bring us over a thousand? Ah, if, you know, we could sell a little bit. We could sell a little bit. Because I want to make sure that we have enough to buy one of those things. Let's, um... Uh, uh, we'll sell... Uh, I want to keep all of our plasma energy because we're going to be using that specifically on the boss. The line right- uh, No! I'm not clicking to the right game. Stop being so sensitive. Um, then let's sell that one. That'll be good for us. Now we can get a power node and be, uh, content with our place in the world. Um, they explain- why, uh, they're like that later. Okay, I see. I I know, but e even if they are like that, it's one of those things where, like, I... I, I don't know. I, I... 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 I just hope they get to be... Uh, the way that I would hope it ends up is that they do get to go back to the real world and learn to love, um, the, the, the beauties of Earth, you know, because... It, it's, um... And once again, like I said, I have definitely been enjoying it so far. I really like the story. Um, and um, more than anything else, it's really been the world, for sure, that has been drawing me in. Because it is such a beautifully cool world. Um, uh, um, what was I going to say after that? Um, screw animes? Animes are cool, Swagonator! Animes are awesome. I like it. Uh, I like animes a lot. I, like I've mentioned before, I kind of fell out, out of animes, which is a little bit unfortunate, but it's it's nice to be getting back into them. Um, but, uh, I, I don't remember what I was going to go off of, so whatever, just forget it. Yeah, I thought there was stasis energy, uh, things here, so that that's pretty freaking glorious. Is it this room over here? I think it's like... 
think it's this door right over here that's the one that requires a power node for? I don't know, a bunch of angry dudes are gonna come and try to touch my butt again, so that's not gonna be fun for anyone. Um, let's go ahead and go- well, actually it'll probably be a lot of fun for them. Oh, wonderful! You, you come out right where I'm coming to chill. Let me, uh, blow you to smithereens if you please. Wow! Only took like three shots for that guy. That's really good! I imagine that's also gonna blow everyone else to bits too, anyone who's like- Oh god, he got close! Hello? Um, I forgot how fast of a runner you are. Um... You should try out for the Olympics, my good sir. Uh, we should probably heal ourselves a bit. Where did he come? Oh, that's the baby. Okay, so the baby, like, popped up. Uh, bye for now. All right, Red Burning Dragon, I hope you enjoy whatever you are going to be doing for the next time being. <laughs> Hello, uh, my good sirs. Can you please just, like, not be of this earthly plane? Die! Okay, apparently it takes closer to like four shots to take those guys down, but you know what, even that's okay. Oh my god, I hate these guys so much. They're the worst enemies ever. Luckily, we're not dealing with any of like the harder difficulty babies. Did that really kill the baby? No, it didn't. It's okay. But it, but it hurt him, so that's good. Oh no, we've only got one more shot! Oh, an explosive one! Leave me be! You shall not last! There we go. Okay. Um, you can- Oh no! Oh! Pro dodges! Pro MLG dodges! That was actually really, really good if I, uh, if I do toot my own horn. Oh my god, please, like, get off of my back. Th these are probably my least favorite areas in the game. I understand why they exist. Oh god, we got blown up. We're almost dead! That's not good. Uh, let's heal twice. That means we're really gonna be low on health items, I think. We've only got three full healing items left. Uh, hello? Oh my god, okay, there's a baby way over there. And we're out of line ammo! That's not good. Hello, how's it going? Uh, mind if I blow off your leg and then destroy your life? That would make me pretty happy, to say the least. Thank you. Um, but I do, I, I do kind of really hate these areas because all it is is just being locked in a room with a million and one enemies continually, like, coming at you. It's, it's just, like, horde rooms, and I prefer, like, the basic kind of flowing, uh, gameplay and stuff like that. Smash the baby. Alrighty, is that it for everyone? Yes? No? Maybe so? Game? I'm imagining it's not, but you know. Um, here, let me catch up on things. Uh, okay, No Game No Life does have a message, not going to say because it is a, a spoiler. Okay, cool, cool. So that sounds, that sounds good. Maybe a season two, the light novel is still continuing. Uh, the sister's like a supercomputer. Um, okay. Uh... Um, that is a real world, just not their world. Okay, so so the world that they get teleported to actually does exist then? That makes me have to imagine that that girl literally is a god then. So that's interesting. Mm. Drink all the liquids. No anime, no life. I can appreciate that. Uh, definitely not my philosophy. Um, but I, but I do like animes. Was there ever a period in my life when I was crazy about animes? There was a period when I, when I started watching a lot of them. But the sad thing about that is, I think that's actually part of what really made me stop watching them as well. Because, um. Really, this is with all media, um, not just animes in general, but that's when I kind of start to realize, at least in my humble opinion, how many animes aren't all that good, um, or at, at least aren't my kind of thing, because I, I, I think audience, I, I mean, animes are for a very, very, uh, specific audience in particular, um, and I don't, I, I definitely also don't think I'm the main target for animes or anything. There it is! I, I knew there was one of them in here. Oh, of course we can't access it until everyone is dead. Hello, are you the final living creature of this, uh, I don't know, roomly plane? Because that'd make me pretty happy um, to be able to deal with it. 
Got to walk my dogs. Have fun with that. Walking dogs can be really fun. Um, sometimes it could be a chore, but uh, if you have some people to talk to, that's what it's really fun, I should say, actually. Because most of the time, I, 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 actually, I don't think it's the most fun thing in the world unless you've got, like, company. Hello, baby! Thank you for coming right to my footstep so I can uh, smash you into oblivion like I've done, your done to your other brethren. Can this, like, lockdown please be disengaged? It's lasting a million years and I just want to, like, get the power node into the spot. Or, or go into the power node room. Make all my dreams come true, but the game just won't let me. Oh, hello. <laughs> this is a body that freaking like, fell from the roof. That's kind of funny. So... Okay, there we go. We're gonna have to deal with a couple more... A couple more explosive guys, apparently. Is there one behind me? No, there wasn't. Okay. You, uh, get out of here. You can get out as well. Thank you. And then anyone else coming to try to ruin my day? Oh, hello! Ayo! Ayo, and goodbye. There we go. That should be dealt with that. Is that it? I think that should- Yes! Oh, praise Jesus! No more of those jerkwads to have to deal with, at least for, for a period. I don't remember if you have to deal with that kind of thing in, like, every room for a while, but I think it actually does at least go on for like the next couple of rooms which is a little bit frustrating but you know it's those things we'll, we'll get through it okay so that's where we came from um any other item containers that we can gain access to uh there's that door but that just leads onwards okay so we just need to go to the power node room i'd imagine this room should have some really good stuff for us since it's like one of the last ones so Naruto has like 600 episodes and it's still going. Yeah, um, I followed Naruto until like the whole Shibudin thing happened or the whole like uh, thing where like 25 years later, I, I know it's not 25, but like uh, after a couple of years passed by, I, I stopped following it then. Um, just because I kind of like, I think that was like the start of the stage where I kind of was falling out of animes. Um, and I don't think I'll ever get back into, like, that stuff of Naruto. If, if I ever get back into Naruto, it'll just be, like, re, uh, rereading the, the, like, old stories in the manga. Like, when, when they were kids and stuff like that. Um, and n none of the new stuff. I'm sure it's good. I have heard from a good amount of people that Naruto really should have ended a while ago and had a, a lot of chances to end as well and i think that's a little bit unfortunate it's I, it wouldn't surprise me if it is kind of like the systems and should like kind of gracefully bow out but you know just one of those things and like i said i haven't seen it for myself so i can't judge i'm just uh, going off of things that i've heard from other people um, love the beauty of- oh god, oh no, no! Is this another one of the- oh my god, it totally is. I hate this guy. He will not leave my life! I don't care if I'm almost there, it's all ruined just by this guy being here. It's gonna take me a million years to- there's two of them?! Oh, good lord. And I actually got rid of uh, the one weapon that apparently kills these guys at a somewhat fat- fast rate. Okay, plasma card, please, please, destroy him. Destroy him! Destroy him! Oh my god. We're so close to cutting off all its limbs! I'm still not sure if that's the only way to kill this guy or not, but you know... I, I just, just kind of like shoot him like all the hell at this point because he really is the most annoying enemy in this entire game. Okay, that one's dead, I think. Yeah, that one's dead. So that's one we won't have to deal with. Let's take out these three in one shot if we can. Or two. Two's okay. <laughs> Could have been a little bit better. Would have preferred one, but you know, that's fine by me. Then destroy the evil one. Obviously, we're losing a ton of our plasma cutter bullets for the boss. Or that are meant for the boss. But it's gonna be worth it. It's gonna be worth it to kill this man. Please just, please just die. Really, I, I, 
I love Dead Space, but this game... I Obviously, I wouldn't know the pain that I suffered having to deal with that guy if he wasn't in the game. But I can't help but feel that I would just like this game a great deal more if that enemy just didn't exist. Oh my god, there's still so much plasma cutter ammo! That is glorious! All the glory and honor is ours. And they actually didn't deal all that much damage to us. So you know what, that, that could have turned out a hell of a lot worse. In all honesty, uh, gain that heal- Oh, both of those healing items. We'll, we'll probably almost certainly, uh... I don't know if we'll, we, we got, like, our ammo's worth from having to deal with those guys, but I think we actually, um... Definitely, maybe even actually came out with more health potential than we had before? With that health upgrade? Uh, gain two of them? I, I don't know, I, I don't know. Whatever. I'm, I'm just trying to, like, create a positive for having to deal with that guy since he's the worst enemy in this entire game. <laughs> oh, it's this guy! Hey, buddy, how's it going? Here, let me chop off your head like I always do. There you go. I could be happy. Really, those guys, they're, they're just, like, upset about everything until they get decapitated. They, they prefer it when they don't have a head. Let's go ahead and also save here. For, because might as well. Might as well. 